hey, could you imagine a whole country that um, someone that is very respected, and we don't even know her. She's a psychiatrist who cares that says enough. She went to school, she's smart, and she cares about the people, or she wouldn't do that. She wrote a book telling the truth about someone that we've allowed to spread hate faster than this virus that no one knows of, and he ain't scared of it, never was. He's disrespectful and rude, and he's spreading hate. I'm scared for the United States of America, and if somebody don't take control, and they're hopefully Jesus Christ in November, they're going to. We're not going to have a good Christmas. Some of somebody's um, who in the hell is profiting from all this hate and anger, separation, lost, killing. There's people dying, throwing bodies. I remember when COVID first started, when you know where it came from. I live across the street from a nurse home. My mom died, and I can see it from the front door. Please, Jesus. They're going to take Medicare and Social Security away. I don't, I've never even heard such a thing. As soon as he started, he said, take the transgenders. <laughs> he tweeted it. Take, take them out. He didn't have nobody's permission. He didn't ask. He just said it because he's crazy. You can't just say it is and it is. But you know what? They found a reason that it is. I'm transitioning. I wouldn't want to go fight in the military right now. I'm going through something that very hard. It was the hardest thing I ever had to admit to myself that I was a woman in a man's body. It is what it is. Jesus Christ, though, we're down less than 60 days of making a decision that's going to affect everything. I hope to God that I spread enough love and fear in this country quick enough to save it. Donald Trump being re-elected should not be an option. When he's... Oh, Jesus, please, Christ. Money has... I said one time, can money, money can't buy presidents. Uh, what is going on? Who's profiting? Barack Obama... Jesus Christ, you and Mrs. Obama were so polite to him that day when that you guys just gave up that respectful home. And you guys lived in it well, I'm sure. Jesus Christ, there was love in it. He turned it from a home into a business in one day. Who cares that he went in and was so mean to every fucking country? I'll run this country before I'll let you let him again. Please, Jesus, help me.